welcome back to our channel. This is Chef Mario with Whispering Roots. For today's video, we're doing a mac and cheese, and it actually it has butternut squash in it. You wouldn't even know that there's butternut squash because why? Butternut squash is like orange and it has the color of like cheddar cheese awesomeness. We're using paprika, two tablespoons of butter, some chicken broth. You can actually use chicken or vegetable broth, and the butternut squash, of course, our pasta, which is pre cooked already, some milk and cheese we're using a little bit of uh, sharp cheddar and monterey jack we're going to use half of a block of each of those cheeses let's get started to start our sauce it's really easy we're just going to add the chicken stock the milk the butter and the butternut squash and since the butternut squash is already pre-cooked we're literally just softening it up and then we're going to throw it in our blender and as soon as that you know is all blended up we're going to add our cheese All right, at this point, we're just gonna take our ingredients. The butternut squash is really soft, as you can see. I compress it down with a spoon, and it's ready to be blended. Now we just add our puree to the pot, turn it back to about medium heat, add our cheese and stir, and then once the cheese is melted, we just add our noodles. salt and pepper and actually we're not going to use pepper this time we're going to use paprika i'll use about a quarter teaspoon of salt a little sprinkle sprinkle there we go and then for paprika i don't trust this one it has stabbed me in the back before so i'm going to do it the right way again another quarter teaspoon add as much or as little as you like and then you taste all right anna try it now that it's been seasoned all right it looks good So good and cheesy. You don't even taste that there's vegetables in there. It just tastes like mac and cheese. It just tastes cheesy. You don't taste squash, but that squash in there has tons of fiber. It adds vitamin C, vitamin A, lots of good nutrition in bulk without having to add a really thick and fattening sauce. 10 out of 10 recommended. It's mm -hmm. delicious, guys. Try it. For the full recipe, look in the description box below and don't forget to like and subscribe. And comment. Let us know what you think. Yes. Bye. Cheers. Yeah! <laughs>